Ő de mindenki, folytatjuk a Fable 3-at. Jó, már túl estem a... Milyen háznál? Naplemente háznál? És most folytassuk a mellékküldetéseket. Na, meg lesz az a száz... Uh, uh, Egy-egy pont... Mindig uh, folytatom tovább. Tehát még kell 25. Buy your wares here, the shop own! Vége szeret egy gyilkossággal folytassuk a harcot. Mind the flames. They're quite hot, you know. Excellent for... Cooking. Anyway, um, hello. Uh, I'm Leslie, and I'm an. Uh, actually, that doesn't matter for now. What I really want to talk about are those layabouts you've probably seen hanging around here, along with their flower-loving, goody two-shoes leader, Reese. They get right up my nose. They do. I mean, it's all peace and love and that. Sickening. Oh, nobody knows how to be evil anymore. <laughs> time we taught them a lesson, I say. Remind them of the power of the dark side. <laughs> Bring back some of the old ways. I was thinking you should kill this Reese. Is that too hot? No, no, let's let's have you do that. And then I'll let you in on the secret that lies uh, it okay, the 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 But only those with true evil because in their that could be you. If you can prove your evilness by killing that Reese fellow. Mm -hmm. Oh, brilliant. Well, have fun slaughtering that lazy do-gooder. Just hurry back once it's done. Lássuk még mennyi minden van itt. Egy gnom már tudom hol van. Két kócs van az egyik teremben.
Hi, mommy, the fuck. Hi, mommy. Mindig ez b***d meg! Még egy ilyen a szemtelenkelésből. És mit mit élek? Te még miért ezt megtenném? Peace and love, peace and love, that's the answer to everything, man. It's just all so beautiful, so beautiful. Universe is beautiful, man. Beautiful! Peace and love, peace and love, that's the answer to everything, man. Oh, man, oh, man! Let's do this.
you actually did it. Wow, <laughs> you're quite the, uh, quite the wicked one, aren't you? Well, beyond here lies an ancient temple of evil. I'm working out how to get in there at the moment. You do well, Cole. Shouldn't take me too long. Come back soon. Thanks for the murder. Me caught. Egy ilyen kérdemetlen házasság. Please, my sweet, please. I'm so sorry. I I'll make it up to you. Well, I've heard that before. And the first few times you disappointed me. Your clumsiness was sort of adorable in its way, but... It's got a bit of a My darling. Please don't. I'm sorry. Please let's not argue. It's so awful. Awfully boring, you mean? Perhaps if you ever won, it would be more interesting. Hmm? When I married my wife, she was all sweetness and smile. Yes, and now she's all bitterness and bile. She bullies me. She berates me. It's horrible. She's horrible. But if I divorced her, she'd get half my fortune, which is quite a bit of money. Oh, I wish I was someone else. Wait. What if she was with someone else? If a fellow like you were to approach her, woo her, tell her you've got more money than I do, she'd divorce me to marry you, and I'd be free and clear. Of course, you wouldn't actually have to marry her. Once she's divorced me, you could just walk away. Oh, I'd love to see the look on her face then. I know it sounds repugnant, but this could be my only way out. Will you do it? Yeah. You'll do it? Oh, this is the first good thing that's happened to me in years. She's inside. You can start there. I'll go to the pub. Get out of your way. It shouldn't be too hard. You go in there and fawn over her, give her exactly. shiny trinkets, she'll be all over you. <laughs> Work for me. What is it now? Don't tell me you want to talk about things. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I thought you were my husband. <laughs> Don't know how I could have confused someone like you for someone like him. <laughs> so, uh, what can I do for you? <laughs> well, hello, handsome. Looking good, looking good. There's Follow me, baby. Oh. I thought croquet was boring. Oh. <laughs> oh. I've been. <laughs> well, handsome. You're quite a bit of fun, aren't you? Much more diverting than that husband of mine. Do you know, he spends all his time reading or gardening. <laughs> so dull. I can't remember the last time he did something nice for me, like buy me jewelry. I adore jewelry, by the way. Look at that. Oh, it is beautiful. Thank you. I love it. You look fine. Hello. I don't know about you. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
You're the... The liar. You are awfully appealing. You know that. It's been lovely spending time with you. And it was exciting at first, flirting <laughs> in my husband's house. But aren't you bored? Mm? We should go somewhere nice. How about Bright Hall Bridge? All right, darling, if you like. That's a love. Our customers have been good to me. I love yes, the do. view here. And you don't ruin it with a lot of talk. You just oh, stand there and look handsome. <laughs> You've done that before, I should think. That, or you have amazing instincts, I have to tell you. I've been with William so long, I forgot how incredible it can feel to be with someone exciting. I want more. What do you say? We make a go of this. I'll leave William, and you and I can be together. You've got a ring, you've got a house. You're gonna be very hard to resist, aren't you? Go ahead and ask and let's see how strong my resistance is. Okay. Will you marry me? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I just have to divorce William. Oh, I wish I'd met you five years ago. Would have spared myself a lot of crushing boredom. Let's look at any William has. I'm sure you'll be satisfied. Nice doing business with you. The best parts are you'll up be amazed close, by our and I have the tools. Prices. I've got news for you, William. You're not going to like it, and let me tell you, that breaks my heart. Truly. I've decided we're not right for each other. More specifically, you're not right for me. So, here are the divorce papers. You may consider yourself an ex-husband. Veronica, I don't know what to say other than thank you. Thank you for doing just what I knew you would. That's gonna be scared for. You planned this all along? Sorry to say. I'll file these with the city clerk first thing tomorrow morning, and then we are officially history. Thanks again. Well, my enterprising love, aren't you a piece of work? You make a deal with a husband to split up his marriage and leave his wife penniless. Rather underhanded, I would say. I wonder. 
Just how despicable are you willing to be? Because if I think this through logically, if he never makes it to that office, the divorce never happens. And then instead of marrying a hot-blooded divorcee, you'd be landing yourself a very wealthy widow. What? You can't mean... You'd kill me? Well, technically, he'd kill you. <laughs> I'm sorry, William, but it is a lot of money. You haven't left me much of a choice. Don't listen to her. You can just walk away. This doesn't concern you anymore. No! Don't go! If I may say so, sir, you have succeeded most admirably in gaining a large measure of popular support among the locals. Jimmy I believe this Tom. would be a good time to return to that You're not rather really going dreary to divorce your true love, that your new you? rebel acquaintances like to call home. You just tried to have me killed, and now you're trying to worm your way back into my heart. I was confused. This whole awful affair has reminded me how much I really love you. Let's just tear up those papers and start again. And as long as we're tearing, maybe we should have at these clothes as well. <laughs> oh. No. Wait a minute. I'm not falling for that. It's over. Get out of my house. Oh, all right, fine. You're a disappointment, William. I wanted to make it work, but if you don't want to try, I'll leave. And I'm taking my jewelry with me. Fine. Good riddance. I don't think I'll get out of here. Jó, most beszélünk követően, hát úgy is kell még erősödnöm. De nem tudok egy előbe menni.
wait. Hi. Rebel Prince, I'm on my way to the castle to report to your brother and to try to find out what I can about his troop movements while I'm there. Ben's in the back room, arguing with Paige. Not an entirely unexpected situation. Ben seems to have a way with a fair sex, a strange troubled way. Callio. No, I, I got it. See that? Good job. Yeah, man. There's one beat. Oh, God. I'm going to hold them. I'm telling you, I downed three hollow men with one shot. It's true. I never trusted a soldier in my life. I'm not going to start now. Well, will you tell her, Walter? Hey, I'm not getting involved. Look, look, here he is. Ask him yourself. Oh, give it a rest. Fine. I'll just stand here quietly then, shall I? You know, for a prince, you're a pretty decent person. People out there are starting Please to believe man. in you. I knew you two would get along in the end. Thank you for taking an interest in my social life, but we have even bigger problems now. Reva. Reva. He's been bleeding the city dry for years now, but it's never been this bad. We decided it was time to hit back. A small group of fighters managed to get into his mansion, but they never made it out. I believe they're alive. You're going to help me find them. Reva hosts some sort of fancy secret society party every week. We don't know what goes on, but we do know what the guests look like. It's the perfect chance to sneak in. Here. You'll have to wear this. Great. Where's my costume? Well, I still can't come. What 
Are you even after the pre hollow men story? Honestly, this is as bad as the army. Now everyone out. I have a party to dress for. Oh, I'll go anywhere I'm going to point us. Make sure no one spies on you. Everyone out. You know, I'm starting to have serious doubts about our relationship. God. I knew I should have gone up to the castle this week. I just love how soldiers can come in and out of our secret hideout now. Whatever you do, please don't let Mr. Finn follow you. I've had enough of him for one day. I'll see you at Weaver's Manor. Ty můj se mozky nemají na měst. Suit should allow you to blend in anywhere, so long as anywhere is a fancy masquerade ball attended by high-ranking members of society. Wear it in any other environment, you'd probably be slightly conspicuous. Now here is where you can fine-tune the more esoteric aspects of your adventuring experience. Not entirely certain I'm using esoteric correctly there, but no matter. Welcome to the live room, where you can interact with the larger world. If there's anything you can't specifically remember about your adventure, it's all recorded here, down to the tiniest detail. You can use this to invite friends of yours here. That really does suit you. Brings out the color in your eyes. Shall we? Again. Yeah, I think. Bit late, aren't you? You missed half the rituals and all the drinking. All we've got left is fizzy pop. Um, we apologize. Oh, yeah. Well, just give me the password and we'll forget all about it. All right. Yes. Uh, the password? No. I'm just pulling your leg. Come on in. No, I know you're keeping up. Master Weave will be happy to have a few more conscious people around for the final ceremony. I wasn't kidding about the fizzy pop, though. These lightweights drank the lot. There's probably some cooking sherry left in the kitchen if you're desperate. Nah, don't blame you. Never touch the stuff myself, well, except in the mornings. I can sort you out a nice orgy later on, should the mood take you. What do you say? Just keep walking, you strange little man. Of course, of course, you'll have to pardon me, miss. I do have a habit of spouting the odd vulgarity. Master Weaver has often brought out his whip to rectify that very flaw with my character. It's just this way. Oh, you'll have such fun. Not drinks and orgies fun, you know, but it'll be a real laugh, I'm sure. Now, there are some ground rules. Master Reaver insists that nobody carries weapons into the ballroom. Yeah, quite there have been some That's for us. I'm afraid I need to keep mine. I'm here to find some friends. Oh, you're the brave noble rebels. Why didn't you say so? I'm an oppressed proletarian myself, you know. 
We're practically comrades. If you just go through these doors, you can sneak past the party and rescue your fellow revolutionaries. There's one of my men. Kid, are you all right? Get out, now. Where are the others? All dead. Reva knew you'd come. He's been waiting for you. What? I'll get him out. My, my, my! More busy little bees here to steal Reva's honey. So industrious, so committed, so bloody annoying. When will you people learn to enjoy life? I'll enjoy killing you. Does that count? Oh, you're just <laughs> full of spunk, aren't you? A true heroine. It must be lightning under the bitchies. And now, as promised, the evening's pièce de la résistance. Another piece of the resistance. <laughs> Voila! Try to put on a good show for my guests, won't you? Show? You expect us to entertain you? Uh, but of oh, course. It's just a game, my little sweet. The Wheel of Misfortune. It's rather simple. I spin. You die. We watch. Really? It's, it's a riot. <laughs> No less than the most unsightly, most obnoxious creatures ever to contaminate this world. Super. Here's a whole bit of car. Shrugs and waits for the next piece of carnage. Reva's worse than I thought. Cool, what kind sorry. of mind dreams up something like this? Ha, this is your boy, not Shaq. Like the tales of my greatest conquests, the wheel simply demands to be spun. What delicious fate will it deliver this time? It's 
just not a real party without the elegant shuffles of these gentlemen, so hallowed and yet so hollow. Come on. The sooner we make our way through this sick game, the sooner we'll get our chance to kill Reva. Let the tearing of limbs commence. Chop, chop. Ah, the satisfying sound of a corpse being thoroughly whacked. What a wonderful spectacle this is turning out to be, ladies and gentlemen. You want to tell your grandchildren you were here? It's a holler man massacre. Bomb house, hold on. Oh, what a shame! Cut down in the prime of death. It may have been struck, but it will never stop. Unless, of course, it struck a few more times and falls over. If he wasn't dead before, come on, he must be now. He's gone down like a sack of spuds. What a heartbreaking performance. The poetry of life and death was unmistakable, and you had to spoil it all by not dying. I'd read about hollow men before, but I'm not sure I ever believed in them. This better end soon. Oh, wheel, let your exquisite circumference regale us with violent thrills. I paid the blood vessel yeah, out of my own pocket. With gold I took from the people, but still, they'd better not disappoint. Mercenaries. Finally. Something I know how to fight. The Hulkos lesz az igazi gond. Iszonyatosan gyorsak. may be lacking, but they do have a way with swords. Away we go! Fight back, you wimps! The toy folks will send his payment to his widow, won't we, Reva? <laughs> Today's mercenaries are 
mercenary is a short and brutish one. It was his first day as well. He should have blocked that, but he didn't. You're rubbish. Miss. about having paid them. It was strictly a no-kill, no-deal arrangement. So you saved me a small fortune. Bravo! I've seen terrible things in my time, but never so much death. Reaver's gonna pay for this. Enough games, Reaver! Oh, but they're such fun, and my guests do so enjoy. Um, time for another spin. Nothing. Oh, now, this is a very special round. Wait till you see what treasures I have in store for you next. Aye, aye. What now? Nice we can't keep fighting forever. Az a dőli biztosan nem lesz egy kámsér. I met these delightful creatures in a rather inhospitable land, far from the turgid green of Albion. I do love to bring two cultures together and see which one dies first. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you. Si a togi furia, a csejte. Si van velősebb. These sand ladies are tough. It'll take more than that to bury one. Oh, you're going to go out to the basics. Oh, no, they'll kill one. It should be a crime to kill such a great creature. Somebody please arrest that rebel. Oh, the sand fury couldn't get out of the way in time. No, it's going to chill. Such a shame to the sands with her. Oh, that's a real shame. Oh, you should have done that for that thing. Oh, my God, oh, my God. Oh, my God, oh, my God. Wasn't that utterly enthralling? Of course, you should be ashamed of yourselves treating foreign visitors in such an unsociable manner. I really had enough of this. Holier than thou idealists, always thinking in the simplest, most binary of ways. But I quite agree. This game grows tiresome, and my guests, they grow restless. No need to get restless, sweetheart. Barry Hatch is here to take care of you. And you could jig. That's not what I thought. That's my guard or shoveless. Weaver, help! No! Oh, dear. Oh, no. Have any idea how hard it is to find good stuff? 
still, one might as well enjoy the show. What's the use of a secret society without a little secret? Ben kell levetni. Ha akkor a véget ír, nem a támadnak. Kettem vannak. Au! Ennyi elég is. Elég egy. This is the last party I take you to. Szemétál. Well, I must say you've made me out to be a somewhat poor host. Rather rude of you to dispose of all my guests. Now it's your turn, Reaver. Kill your daughter. Oh, my dear girl, why not stop all this bickering? The three of us could go up to my quarters and have a private party. Do you have any idea who this is? It's Logan's brother, the prince. The king's brother, a bona fide hero. Well, I wouldn't dream of coming between siblings. Well, that's that's not strictly true. There was that time. Hmm. Anyway, best of luck with this whole revolution hey, luck. Perhaps we'll meet again one day. Tatty bye. Bloody coward. Would someone mind getting us out of here now? <laughs> I never thought I'd side with royal blood, but you're nothing like your brother. The Bowerstone resistance will follow you without question. So long as you promise to change things when you take the throne. Poverty, children forced to work, people living in fear. You have to make it stop. I promise. We should get back. We've got a revolution to plan. See you again. support of Bowerstone and its underground resistance, but you still have much to do before you can take Albion's throne. That's my me. Ah, Yama. Yeah. 
ha négy is húzódnak, a könnyebb lesz egy a falkasokat. The speech will commence shortly. What's going on? All citizens gather at the castle for the king's message. The speech will commence shortly. This is never good. You should find out what it's about. I'd come with you, but there's a reason we stay underground. We'll see you at the base when it's over, all right? Walter. Yes, traitors walk amongst us. Traitors plot to end us. Traitors would have you believe their cause is noble. They wear many masks. They may look like your friends. They may even look like your most loyal servants. This, this is the face of a traitor. Swift. Major Swift. Swift. A respected member of the army and sworn servant of the kingdom has plotted against us all. He was apprehended attempting to turn loyal soldiers against us and is thus charged with espionage, treason and conspiracy. <gasps> Yet there are still others darkening our land with their betrayal. We shall hunt these traitors down wherever they may be and they shall suffer the same fate as major swift the fate of all enemies of the crown he has to be stopped no matter what it takes Quite he fun. has to be come on we need to tell the others Hát ez most egyelőre várhatnak. Mondjuk ezt most egyelőre. Oké, okay, srácok, ennyi volt már a hasztó. Hát ez nem olyan kutya, mint amit gondolod. Az a helyzet, hogy talán nincs kerítés. Nincs kerítés, hogy bekerítsem őt. Könnyen megszökik. Úgy kell ejtenem ahhoz, hogy ne jöjjön utána. De nincs ketrecünk. Úgy úgy kéne ejteni, hogy nincs ketrecünk. De nincs ketrecünk. De nincs ketrecünk. Könnyű. 